Well, right here in St. Louis, one company is improving the lives of many through just a simple blood test. It is helping thousands who have to face Alzheimer's every day. It's a devastating disease that can affect the patient and the rest of the family. Justina Cornell learned that this local company is doing and how this new tool is working. Wow, what a medical breakthrough for Right, this. Kelly. So the company is C2N Diagnostics, and it has been in business since 2007. And it was near the end of 2020 when it introduced its latest product. Now, this blood test can help detect if you have Alzheimer's or other memory issues. This helping many families, including the Behans. Both my husband and I, um, we met here in, in St. Louis, and we were married in St. Louis. Going down memory lane, Alice Behan remembers all the beautiful moments spent together with her husband, Patrick. I really, I fell in love with him pretty fast. The duo tied the knot 53 years ago, making the pact in sickness and in health. Alice standing by his side through it all. He started to lose his memory little by little. He was always diagnosed as Alzheimer's dementia. The journey began four years ago to see if Patrick had Alzheimer's. They said one of the ways we could do it is maybe do a spinal tap. However, a newer and simpler answer came about right here in St. Louis. It starts off with a simple uh, blood draw. The company C2N Diagnostics just introduced an innovative testing tool called Precivity AD Test in late 2020. On a scale, it can detect if memory and cognitive issues at hand are Alzheimer's or other conditions, a process that is much quicker. For many patients, it can take six months up to a year um, or possibly even more than that to actually figure out what is causing the progressive memory decline. And it gives patients a more accurate diagnosis, which improves patient care. Up to 50, 30 to 50 percent of the time that diagnosis can be incorrect. Patrick took the test recently, and a four-year question was finally answered. The doctor came on and said, Alice, I have to tell you that Pat does not have Alzheimer's. Oh my gosh, this is just wonderful. He said, well, Alice, he has frontal lobe dementia. While it's still a hard pill to swallow, Alice has more direction. For me to get that clarity and to get some sense of where I'm going next. A new route that her and her husband can maneuver together. It just sort of changes your course and changes your life whether it gone either way, it's just life changing. Now this test is intended for anyone over the age of 60 and it's aimed at those who have memory or cognitive issues. The best advice to take a test, be proactive if you are noticing signs and talk to your clinician that they'll determine if this is the right test for you or your loved one.